Hey, Joe Biden's on the line. Hello? Hey, man, it's Joe Biden. What's up? Anything interesting uh, going on in current events? You watch the Olympics? Uh, Joe, what's happening in Afghanistan? Don't you know already? <laughs> For Pete's sake, get on the ball, man. <laughs> we got him. We just killed bin Laden. We killed Lynn Bodden. Mission accomplished. Don't you watch Deborah Norville? Oh, my God. <laughs> Show. We, ju- we didn't just kill bin Laden. Okay, I admit, <clears throat> I admit it. He's still out there. But, but I swear to God, on my word as a Biden, we will bring him to justice. Just give us a few more years in Somalia or Libya. <laughs> Or wherever the fuck he is now. <laughs> that guy's slippery. Like my dad used to say, it's hard to catch a frog once he's been into bacon grease. What? We're looking in Greece, too. I'm serious. This is no joke. I'm not, I'm not kidding, I swear. Hunter needs another oil job. I can't afford to buy another one of his paintings. They look like crack dreams. Uh, Vietnam War vets are comparing what uh, this to what happened in Vietnam. You know that. No comparison. The likelihood of the Viet Cong overrunning everything and owning the whole country is highly unlikely. Uh, Joe, we're 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 not talking about Vietnam. Jesus, I know that. Will you stop? Okay, let's just assume you're right for a moment. What are we talking about then? Afghanistan. I knew that. Listen. Firstly, the likelihood of the Taliban overrunning everything and owning the whole country is highly unlikely. You have my word as a Biden. How many times do I have to say it? But they, but they just did that. Did what? They, they overran the whole country. Look, man, this is, this is not proper discourse. <laughs> you have to stop correcting me when I say stupid shit or we'll throw you <laughs> off my spec case. Look. Despite the current setbacks, I'm still confident Afghan security forces have the capacity to sufficiently defend the airport parking lot and with God's help eventually take back the smoking lounge and the pizza hut. However, the Mr. Softy truck is a complete loss. But things are looking up. Did you see those warlords riding the bumper cars yesterday? Our charm offensive is working. Just wait until they hit False Flags Magic Mountain. The walls are closing in on the Taliban. So who's to blame for all this, Joe? Look, I, I've only been doing this for 50 years. <laughs> so, so I blame the Afghan people. Jesus, They weren't up to the challenge of our freedoms. Plus, they weren't convincing when they kept telling us to leave. And that's always a sure sh- sign a country wants you to stay. Joe, is there a silver lining to any of this? Of course, man. The CIA says we're really making progress in Syria. Uh. But it's going to be a quagmire. So stay the course. And don't forget to buy one of Hunter's crack dreams, you cheapskate. (laughs) The Jimmy Dore Show is coming to a city near you August 28th. We're in Las Vegas at the Plaza. And we just added another show in Portland. We're there in Portland on September 10th and 11th. October 3rd, we're at Harlow's in Sacramento. More dates being added. Go to JimmyDoreComedy.com for a link for all tickets. See you at a live show. (laughs) 